Okay, here we are. Got the uh, Dragon bike. Just finished it up. Just need to put a few little finishing, polishing touches on it. And, but she's all, uh, she's all there now. Got um, the uh, owner wanted to uh, name the bike the Black Dragon, so um, asked if I'd do a little bit of theme work with that. So this is kind of what I came up with, kind of a dragon skin uh, look all over the outside, skin over the, the heat shield, and uh, kind of a different dragony look, I guess, in the uh, in the front. See the motor mounts. This is a new uh, fuel system that I've got going here with the, uh, it's all push button throttle. Um, my super twins have two fuel pumps on them, so all you do is turn one fuel pump on and, and that gives you a uh, start and idle. And then you just hit the second fuel pump and it gives you full throttle. But this has a single fuel pump on it, but I still wanted to have push button start. So um, I've, you've got your fuel pump right here, lines coming down out of the fuel tank into the fuel pump. Fuel pump goes down to this bar, goes over, and then it goes out to that solenoid right there. And it goes out of the solenoid, and then it goes back up into the fuel tank. And what uh, you do is there's a needle valve on the end of that right where it goes into the tank. And when you open, when you turn the fuel pump on, which is what starts the engine, it also opens up that solenoid right there and lets a little bit of the fuel go back to the tank, which you can adjust with the needle valve. So it lo lowers your pressure a little bit for starting, and then it idles. So when you push the button, for the fuel pump, it also opens that up, which lowers your pressure so you start and you idle. Then when you uh, hit that red button right up there, that red button turns off the uh, solenoid, which makes all the fuel then go to the engine, which increases the fuel pressure. So it instantly jumps to full pressure uh, to the engine and full throttle that way. So it's all just uh, push button. We've got, um, we've got uh, that's your, your main button you push uh, to start the bike. Um, you've got your uh, spark on the left. Push that. You have to push the, the spark to um, to um, start the bike and then and then your other button there is your uh, is your full throttle. And of course you just push it on and off however you want the uh, the bike to throttle. Then uh, the battery is uh, right there. <clears throat> then we've got a uh, 3.2 million volt uh, stun gun that's uh, sitting right here that um, produces the spark for the for the bike. And then, uh, of course, this uh, bike, um, the customer sent me the bike frame, so it I didn't build the frame on this one. Uh, so I so you have to kind of go around what you've got for a frame. Of course, I uh, changed the uh, the mount for the seat here and gave it a really cool tank. I really like this tank. Um, it's really a neat design. It's real sleek, and of course it was supposed to have kind of a dragon scale look uh, for this bike, but uh, um, I think I'll probably use this on uh, on some other bikes, and I'm building a big 250 pound thrust drag bike right now, and uh, it'd be really cool to, to use a, a nice sleek tank like that on that. So, um, so this one's already, I just have to uh, fire it up and and uh, test to make sure the uh, the fuel system and everything's running right, uh, which I'll be doing that here in just a few hours, I suppose. So that's a new uh, that's a new bike. It's pretty cool.